what is the value of a given that you have 5 to the power of a equals 60 so from here let's have it to be solution so from here let's take the log of both sides so we are going to have it to be log 5 to the power of a equals log 60 then let us recall that when we have log p to the power of m this power m will come down to base to be m multiplied by log p so from here this we have here to be a multiplied by log 5 equals log 60 this power a we come down to base here then mind you that we can have 60 to be equals 5 times 12. so when we substitute it here we are going to have a multiplied by log 5 equals log 5 times 12 then let's put them in parentheses so having done this one again, let us recall that when we have log a times b always equals as when we have log a plus log b. So from here, we are going to have from here a multiplied by log 5 equals log 5 plus log 12 by applying this one here. So let's divide through by this log 5. So we're going to have it to be divided by log 5. This will also be divided by log 5. So this will cancel out this. Here will be only a left. Then we have log 5 plus log 12 all divided by log 5 so when we divide log, log 5 by this log 5 divide this log 5 by log 12 so we are going to have a to be equals log 5 divided by log 5 plus log 12 divided by log 5 so here will be a equals log 5 divided by log 5 will be 1 plus log 12 divided by log 5. But we have to note that 12 equals 4 times 3. So when we also apply it here, we are going to have a to be equals 1 plus log 4 times 3, put them in parentheses, then divided by log 5. So we are going to have, so from here, we are going to have a to be equals 1 plus this can be simplified as log 4 plus log 3 all divided by log 5 so we have a to be equals 1 plus we can divide this by this as log 4 divided by log 5 plus log 3 divided by log 5. So from here, remember that we can have 4 to be equals 2 to the power of 2. So here will be a equals 1 plus log 2 to the power of 2 divided by log 5 plus log 3 divided by log 5. 
So we have a to be equals 1 plus this will come down to base here to be 2 multiplied by log 2 divided by log 5 plus log 3 divided by log 5. Then let us record that when we have log a divided by log b always are equals as log of a in base b. We apply this one here. So we have our a finally to be 1 plus 2 multiplied by this will now be equals log 2, this 2 in base 5 plus log 3 then in base 5 and this is the final answer for the value of A if you are new here and find this video interesting don't forget to share, like, comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more math tutorial videos then let us now check so we have 5 to the power of A equals 60 and our 5, our A equals 1 plus log 1 plus 2 multiplied by log 2 in base 5 plus log 3 in base 5. So when we substitute it here, we are going to have 5 to the power of 1 plus 2 multiplied by log 2 in base 5 plus log 3 in base 5. Then the question now is, is it going to give us 60? Then let us recall that when we have a to the power of m plus n, this always equals as a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n. So we are going to apply this one here. So, so from here, definitely we are going to have 5 to the power of 1 multiplied by 5 to the power of 2 multiplied by log 2 in base 5 multiplied by 5 to the power of log 3 in base 5. So we share this 5 for this, this, and this, and this. Then is it going to give us 60? So from here, 5 to the power of 1 will give us 5 multiplied by 5. We can take this one as 5 to the power of log 2 to the power of 2. We take this one back to this power. Then in base 5, multiply by 5 to the power of log 3 in base 5. Then it's going to give us 60. So we have here to be 5 multiplied by 5 to the power of log 2 to the power of 2 give us 4 in base 5 multiply by 5 to the power of log 3 in base 5 then it's going to give us 60 then let us recall that anytime when we have a to the power of log b in base a so far this base and this are the same so the output of this expression will be equals b so when we apply it, this base and this are the same. This base and this base are the same. Applying this one, the output will be 3. Apply this one, the output will be 4. So here will now be 5 times 4 times 3. Then the question now is, is it going to give us 60? So from here, 5 times 4 will give us 20 times 3 is going to give us 60. 3 times 0 will give us 0. 3 times 2 will give us 6. This equals 60. And this also equals 60. So the left hand side equals to the right hand side. So this implies that A equals 1 plus 2 multiplied by log 2 in base 3 plus log base 5 plus log 
3 in base 5 satisfy the problem given to us. So if you are new here and find this video interesting, don't forget to share, like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more maths tutorial videos. Bye-bye.